I'm standing here in a typical Motaku forest island that you'd find in the Beni Savannas. If you notice, there's very little understory. But this is not a natural situation. This is a result of cattle grazing. And this is caused by cattle that come in the area to rest during the evening, avoid cold fronts, and to dry off their hooves from all the flooded savanna. But as a consequence, they've so seriously devastated the regeneration of these forest islands. But well, we've looked at these motaku palm trees, like this one here. This, this tree is about 70 years old, but there's no regeneration. So there's a gap of about 60 years where no motaku palm trees have taken in the environment. And what that means is that if this situation continues for the next 100 years, we're going to see most motoku palm trees die off, and probably the savannas of Beni lose about 90% of their palm trees. I'm standing in one of the main forest islands in the Barbasul Nature Reserve. This island has undergone about 100 years of cattle pressure, so to the point that when we purchased the reserve, this island was absolutely bare. Cattle um, foraging in the area, hoof pressure, and ranchers taking out all the big trees had created an island with only trunks and almost no regeneration below. We removed the cattle from the area five years ago, and now we're seeing this incredible regeneration of understory. And mostly it's predominated by this, which is the motaku palm tree. I would say for every one motaku palm tree standing, there must be about 10 young saplings ready to come up and take its place.